Again. One, two, one, two. Again. Two. Two, three, two. Again. It's the best cardio out there. It's another level of conditioning, man. Definitely. What's up, Muscle and Strength? I'm Robert Timms. I'm Jesse Keller. And we're with Gaspari Nutrition. Uh, we're here at Sunny's Boxing Gym, and we're about to get a workout in. Cardio can get monotonous, and this is a great way to do our cardio without um, having to go run or something that's steady, you know, constant all the time. We just like box it, it burns the calories fast, it's great hit cardio, and it's, it helps us through our fitness journey. Sunny will put us through uh, some type of warm up. So basically getting our shoulders, our arms, and our lower body ready. So the first drill that we did is we came in and there's a 45 pound plate that's just on a piece of carpet. And we basically slide it down one side of the gym and back and that's one repetition. Push, baby, push. Push through it, baby, push through it. Push, 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 push. The standard sled push, you can actually use more of your, your glutes hamstrings and stuff like that to push the weight. This one is more quads because you're literally bent down to the ground and trying to slide a weight. It's a lot different because you're pushing down all your body weight instead of using your glutes and everything in a stand-up type of position. Next exercise is the mitts, and that definitely works the shoulders. Make sure you keep your hands up even through exhaustion. Now, granted, it's not like fighting someone because you have nobody punching back, but it's still a great cardio workout, um, especially if you have somebody knowledgeable that's holding the mitts who can run you through the training and um, ensure that you're doing the proper punches. Ha, two, three, two. Ha, ha, ha. Again. Ha, ha, ha. One. Ha. One. Ha. One, two. Ha, ha. One, two, three. Ha, ha, ha. Again. Ha, ha, ha. Again. Ha, ha, ha. One, two, one, two. Again. Two. Two, three, two. Again. One. 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 One, two, three. Again. 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 One. 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 One, two. One, two. Two. Two, three, two. The numbers and the punches that's thrown. You know what I mean? So, you know, be, the jab being a one, the right hand being a number two, the hook being a number three. So typically all boxers go by those numbers. Two, two, three, two. Again, again, again. One, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. Faster, faster. Bring it, suck it up, baby. Now or never, let's get it. Get it, bring it. Suck it up, baby. Let's get it. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, ah. three, two, ah. Once you break that comfortable state, now it's a mental push. And that's probably for me right after the minute and 45 second mark. And then it's. <laughs> all mental and you know, you gotta mentally push yourself. So typically Sonny will run like some kind of hand drill with us. So we'll go in for a boxing drill and then he'll run us through some type of either cardio and muscular type of movement and endurance movement. So he, uh, he got us uh, the medicine balls and as we're going through with the medicine balls, it's basically like a, an advanced burpee, I guess you could call it. I don't know if it has a real name. But you'll throw the ball up, do a push up, stand up, roll into a kind of like a sit up position on your back and then you roll with your momentum coming up. And this is basically again just kind of keeping your heart rate up but it's still using all the aspects of your shoulders, your core and your lower body to all stabilize this one. Let's get it, let's get it. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. I 
I personally like the reps more, you know, because I, I, I strive to get to that that number. I like that having that definitive number. But you can do the same thing with your own head. In, in your own head, you say, I got a minute. I want to. I want to make sure I get this many reps in. So you can do it both ways. But if I don't have a set rep range, I don't know. Not saying that I won't push as hard, but I don't think that my mentally I will force myself past that point. So not only is it just your shoulder moving it left from right, but your core is, I mean, it is tight. You know, I was catching cramps the whole time, so I was trying to move like my feet to try to alleviate that pain into a different side of my core. Um, and again, another you know time scenario where you're counting down time. I wasn't really sure how long he was going to have us go, so I just wait and hope to pray that he's going to start the you know 20 second countdown. Um, but man, that is a, a, it's definitely a shoulder burn. You can feel it. It's a lot different from doing the the, the standard I think rope that a lot of people do. Move that rope, move that rope. Five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, you know, you watch a fight, a boxing match, and you tell, and you're, you're, you're trying to be in the screen and you, in the, in the middle of the fight, and you hear, or you see the guys you know, wearing down in this, like the last few rounds, and like they're in round 10, and you know, you're like, just hit him, hit him with the, and you're like, but in my head, I'm looking at myself here doing one round, and I'm in the last minute and a half, and I can barely lift my arms. So it's one of those kind of respect things you get um, from going through it, and then now you see it, and you're just like, you have to give them, give them their props for, you know, being able to do what they do. Oh, you gotta be in an elite level, man. I mean, definitely gotta be in an elite level, because uh, boxing and conditioning is another, in other sports, it ain't the same, you know? Those were the worst because they're more stabilizing than anything. So you had to stabilize yourself on your butt. Um, and I was, I ain't gonna lie, I was cheating. So what? I put, I put my feet down. Um, and I used the, the bar and you touch each side. It is no joke. Um, like I said, you just gotta give respect from doing these simple workouts and then seeing boxers, you know, it just, it just gives you a whole different view on their, their lifestyle and their workout training styles. Keep that core tight. There it is, there it is. It's good, feet off the ground, feet off the ground. Let's get it, let's get it. Let's get it, let's get it. It's supposed to hurt, let's go. We got 30 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. All right guys, that was our workout. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe below.